Hello everyone, welcome back to Coral Joy Travel. Today I'm doing a mail unboxing. I've had some things in my P.O. box that I've let accumulate. There's actually just three things here, but there was a few more that I opened up privately. Um, but I wanted to share these with you. This big box is from a friend on the West Coast, Drew, and he has sent me some goodies before, but oh my word, would you look at the size of this box. It says, handle with care, um, Incredibles am up to no good. Hmm, I wonder if that's a hint, Drew. This is a pin that I purchased that I want to show you because it's part of a collection that I'm collecting for 2018. And this was a pin trade, but guys, it's bigger than a pin trade. It's from a, from a friend of mine named Nikki. So let's just jump right into this unboxing because I cannot wait to see what's inside. And I have on... Well, I have opened up these two, but I wanted to show them to you because, you know, because that's just the kind of person I am. So let's just go. I want to start with this one from Nikki. We did a pin trade. We are both collecting pins, and she mentioned that she would like one of the pins I had. So I said, hey, and it was a duplicate pin. I said, hey, would you like it? And she said, sure. And then she showed me her trader. So let me show you the trade I got because I think I scored. Check this guy out. It's Mike Wazowski with a D. And this is a limited edition. Oh my gosh, does it move? <gasps> Inside the D, there's um, a scream, a scream container for Monsters Inc. And it looks like the Monsters Inc. symbol. I didn't know it would do that. It's like. You can't see, but I'll show you a close-up of this. I don't know what the LE size is. Let me see if I can read it without my glasses. Oh, I can maybe. Help. A limited edition of 3,000. I'm trying to read the year. My eyeballs cannot read the year, but LE of 3,000. I would imagine it was kind of a newer pin. Maybe this year, maybe last year. I don't know if you know when this year uh, the year of this pin, just let me know in the comments below, or I can get my readers on and then be able to see that. Um, I will show you a close-up of this in a moment, but I want to show you what else Nikki added in my pin trade. She wrote me a little note. Story time. Hi, Coral. Thanks so much for reaching out and trading with me. I had this extra shirt and thought you might like it. Hope it fits. A, it does. B, I like it. C, let me show you them. Here is that Mike Wazowski pin. You can see the inside. Oh, you can see the inside here. But look, it actually does move if I shake it. Come on, baby. It, it, it moves. It's not going to, it's just not going to cooperate now. But it does. Isn't that so cool? And it has two pin backs to secure it. And you guys, check out the shirt. Um, it's gold and it says snack goals and these are my snack goals. I think my favorite one, I can't pick a favorite one, let's be real. I'll be wearing this in Walt Disney World. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Nikki. Seriously, so sweet. Let me now fix my ears, and show you the lunchtime tail pin for June of 2018. This is released both in Walt Disney World and in Disneyland. And I have every single one of these. They come out once a month. And for the month of June, which is my birthday month, the theme was Emperor's New Groove. I have watched this movie, but not in a long time. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not going to say it wasn't one of my favorites, but it probably wasn't, which is totally fine. So I'm not really like, I'm, I just, I don't know that much about this movie, but I'm collecting all the pins because I love these lunchbox pins. And I'm sure some of you absolutely love Emperor's New Groove, and that's awesome. Probably if this came out when my kids were littler, or younger, I would have liked it a lot more and I would have watched it a lot more, like I did with Toy Story and Monsters Inc. and Incredibles and etc. So let me show you this one up close because it really is cute. 
Here is the outside and again, the inside. Every one of these is just themed so incredibly. So I think these are limited edition of 1500 and I have all six of them so far that they've released. They will release six more and I will continue to get them because I love them. And you guys, last but not least, let's open up this package from Drew. And it says handle with care, so I shall do that. Drew, thank you so much for sending me goodies. You are just so very kind and you're always commenting on my videos, uh, even on Facebook, so I appreciate that. And I'll just say, if you are not yet subscribe to this channel and you like watching mail unboxings or Disney tips and tricks videos or vlogs, consider subscribing today because this is what I do on my channel multiple times a week. Look at the packaging. Drew, you know how to secure things from the West Coast, my friend. You sure do. I will be reusing this bubble wrap because I send things out all the time. Oh my goodness, I love it. It's like paper and it has notes. Handle with care, Coral O Buckley, Fragile. Caution, happy Pixar birthday week. Oh my goodness, Drew. My birthday was 10 days ago. 10, holy moly. Oh my goodness. Um, Cooper is very intrigued right now. I am, I am extremely intrigued. Let me start with this right here. It's a box. I believe it's Incredibles themed. I do see Incredibles 2 on the box. So let's see what is in this box. What is this? OMG. It's an Incredibles 2 analog alarm clock? That's awesome! Or I should say, that's totally wicked! That's what I should say, right? That is what I should say. Let's check this bad boy out. I'm gonna keep this on my desk, in my office. It is so cool, so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I believe I probably need to, yeah, I gotta get uh, one AA battery in there, which I don't have right now, but I have down in uh, my house. Check out this awesome clock. Drew, thank you. How cute is this? Oh yeah. I think we should say it is incredible. How perfect. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Some of you may know that I live north of New York City a little bit but in the country, and our power seems to go out quite frequently, so having a battery-operated clock is actually very handy. I'm gonna put that right there by my poster. My background's changing a little bit, guys, and you'll notice it does change some more. It's not done, but I'm playing around with it, so you'll kind of get an idea, and give me some ideas if you have suggestions with my background, let me know. I'm still working with it. Guys, there's so much in here, I, I don't even know where to start, but I'm starting, oh my gosh, this is so funny. I just had a Mike Wazowski pin that I traded for, but check out this Mike Wazowski pencil. I think it's a pencil, or it might be a, oh, it's a pen, it's a pen. A Mike Wazowski pen with from Monsters Inc. I love Mike Wazowski. Check out this, that topper is so cool. Thank you, Drew. I love Mike, I love Sully, and I love Monsters, Inc. again because I watched that over and over and over again when my boys were toddlers. And this will go so good with my MU hat that I have and I wear when I'm down in the Disney parks, so thank you, Drew. This is filled with so much stuff. Don't know what this is, but I'm gonna open it up. It's all packaged so, so well. Stop it! Oh my gosh! Are these pencils or pens? I think these are pens too. Okay, these are all 
pens. We have an incredible, they're all incredible pens. Um, Elastigirl oh, and the Mode pen. They look like they're pops too. Baby Jack Jack. And this is either Mr. This is Mr. Incredible. I was going to say it's either Mr. Incredible or Dash. And then we have another pencil that says really positive words. That says really positive words. Amazing. Dy dynamite. Wow. Kudos. I'm truly grateful. High five. Awesome. Excellent. Etc. Oh, there's Mr. Incredible. And it's a pen. Baby Jack Jack. Here's my Elastigirl. I love this. I had to get, I had to get ready for this one. Okay, I had to get ready for this one. Here we go. We've got Edna Mode and Edna Mode. Come on, that's awesome. Oh, hold on, hold on. Whoa, we've got ears falling off my head. It's very dangerous here in this house. Drew, it just continues. I haven't, I don't even have any of this stuff. They are just. So, so thoughtful. Drew obviously knows that I am very much into The Incredibles. I did go to the premiere of Incredibles 2. I did dress up as Edna Mode. I will link that above because I'm very proud of my Edna Mode outfit that I wore. <laughs> because why not? I should be. Um, I'm gonna find my scissors, you guys. Oh, I don't know what I did with them. Looking for my scissors. My ears, here they are. I had to find my scissors. This is a key ring, and it has an option to get lots of the different Incredibles 2 um, characters, and then it looks like there's two mystery characters. So let's, let me show you these. So these are the options we could get, but then these are, oh, this way, two. Mystery. So let's see which one we get. I would, of course, who do I want? Edna Mode. But it doesn't matter which one I get because they're all awesome. Oh, it is not Edna Mode. Who is this? Okay, I'm not going to give it away, but um, if you haven't watched Incredibles 2, this is a character in the movie. I will say no more because I won't spoil the movie. But it's a key ring. And I will be putting that on my Disney backpack right now. Actually, after I'm done with the film, because, you know, it would take too long. But there's more! There's more! Oh my gosh. Just more! OMG! <gasps> he got me another one of the keychains! What is this? Oh. This, oh, wow, oh. this is probably a clue as to what's in here is my guess. So let's open this one up. I think this is going to be a pin. Ooh, I don't know what pin it is, but it has two pin backs on it. True. It's a mystery. It's a mystery. Oh, oh my gosh, I saw this. This is, I think this one might be from Box Lunch. Correct me if I'm wrong. We don't have a Box Lunch around here. I know, crazy news. Crazy, crazy, crazy news. But look at it, it's the Monsters Inc. Scare Door of Boo. Little Boo's door. And inside the door, it opens up, and there's Mike and Sully. I love this so much. And before, before I show you this last pin, I'm going to open up this extra keychain and see which one is in this. I, I wonder where you got these, Drew. I wonder if these are from... Maybe Hot Topic? I don't know. Let me know. I mean, if anyone knows where these are from, <laughs> let me know because I just might need to get lots more of these. I like them. <gasps> you I figured it was appropriate for me to put on my hair. Guys, I'm having a little bit of a bad hair day. My hair doesn't store very well. 
um, but just pretend that it looks really good because Edna's hair should be spot on because she's a fashion girl. And actually it's kind of appropriate that mine isn't because I am not, I'm a Disney girl. So let me show you who I got. Do you think I got Edna? Do you think so? Let's see. You guys, darlings, I'm done. I'm done. Julia the best, thank you. Sit down, her hair is even better. So the last thing that I see in Drew's amazing mystery box is it looks like it might be a journal. It is, it's a journal and this is not Disney themed. This is Harry Potter themed and something Something else I love and that's near and dear to my heart is Harry Potter, that series of books. I love them. Uh, recommend reading those to your kids or having them read them. If they're old enough to read them and comprehend them, what a great thing to do this summer to start reading that series. But this is a journal and it, it is um, actually sealed in plastic, so I will leave it sealed right now. Um, but it's just so beautiful. It has on the outside Hogwarts, Quidditch. Um, so it looks like it's really Quidditch themed. It looks kind of like a newspaper with some information about the broomsticks, the golden snitch, etc. with the different houses on there as well. So thank you so much, Drew. Isn't this just beautiful? Wow. Um, I am just blown away. I love getting mail. I mean, who doesn't love getting mail? I love getting mail. But more importantly, I love the family that we've created here on Coral Dry Travel. Thank you so much for being a part of it. I have a lot of fun. I hope that's obvious. And I hope you continue to enjoy the videos that I share, whether it be, like I said, this one being a mail unboxing or we're doing something new. If you have some ideas or some recommendations for videos, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear what you'd like me to do in the future. And if you're not yet subscribed, consider subscribing today. I'll see you in my next Disney video. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. Coral Joy Travel, a touch of magic, sharing joy. Bye, guys.